see if you can guess where I am. It's hard to tell when there's trees in the way, but the shape of the trees should be a bit of a giveaway. Now, what I'm actually walking on is a disused railway line. Rails have long since been removed, but the telltale shape of the trees arcing over is a bit of a giveaway. Specifically, I'm walking on what remains of the line between Bolton, that way, and Bury behind the camera, in that direction. In general, there's not a lot of evidence that there was a railway here. However, where I am now, look at that view. Just look at it. Yes, I'm on an old railway viaduct. You can clearly see there would have been space for one track here and another track just here. I'm not sure which way round it would be. Well, I do know that it's, it would have been this side because here in the UK, trains run on the left, just like on the road. But I don't know which is up and which is down because generally speaking, with one or two exceptions, railways in the UK up means towards London and down means away from the capital as such. So I'm currently standing close to but not actually on the site of the former Darcy Lever train station which was the first between Bolton and Bury, having well the station of which along with the others between Bolton and Bury closed in 1951 but the line remained in use until 1970. But nonetheless, like many disused railway lines, it's been converted into a cycle track. As for why I'm here, sometimes with the hustle and bustle of uni, I think it's good to just relax, you know, taking in the views at a more leisurely pace than a train would have done. Having said that, for people who have lived here longer than I have, perhaps it would have been more convenient than buses, let's say. Just speculating. So I've probably captured your curiosity as to where this line originated from. Turns out, having just looked up what it was just now, it was a section of the Liverpool and Bury Railway, which opened in 1848. And as mentioned earlier, the stations between Bolton and Bury closed in 1951. Although, there are sections of the aforementioned route that still survive in intended use. Not this modern built uh, bridge for people walking like myself and those with bikes. Uh, but actually in live railway use, like the section between Wigan and Kirby, for example, is still in use as is the rest beyond Kirby into Liverpool. Yeah, that gives an idea of what I do when I'm trying to chill out. And yeah, I'll see you soon. By the way, this is St Peter's Way. Or, as people sometimes nickname it, the Devil's Road, aka 
the A666. Is it fair to call it Devil's Road? Who am I to say? <laughs> 